All right, Hades Omega here, and welcome to another Hades Omega video. So today we're gonna do, we're gonna ride my new buddy here, the Honda Super Cub. All right, we're gonna ride it up the Sierra Road hill climb. All right, and the downhill too. Okay, we'll go up and we'll go down. I won't do the whole thing. Uh, maybe some other time. Um, so if you guys don't know, Hades Omega, this is this is Hades Omega's uh, benchmark. Uh, benchmark drive, okay, or benchmark uh, ride is what I, what I like to do use a uh, Sierra Road for. It's not it's not super long ride, but it's really twisty, okay, and it's pretty steep, so it's a good test of the bike's performance and handling. <laughs> I just want to say, all right. So so yeah, here we go, man. I do the I've done this with all my bikes, okay. My my impulse the. Uh, the Impulse, uh, the Light B, my DR650. I don't know what these people are walking up here, man. Oh, look at that. Already, already I have to go in the third gear. A wide open throttle, man. The Super Cub is not a hill climbing machine. My Light B will just tear up this hill, man. <laughs> but no, I'm in third gear at 30 miles an hour right now. I did bring a GPS also, so I could kind of record some stats and stuff. Dude, where it is, it is not climbing, dude. This is a pretty. I'm not gonna lie, it is a pretty steep hill, but I'm wide open throttle in third gear, and it is not accelerating. <laughs> now we've made it to third, almost 32 miles an hour. I think we're gonna be in mostly second and third gear most of the time. All right, here we go, first corner. Down the shift. It gets around the corner pretty good though, I'll tell you that. But it just it's just gutless going up the hill. I I, I guess the uh, the downhill ride will be more exciting than the uphill ride. All right, if you guys don't know, hey, oh, look at that beautiful San Jose out there. It is a nice warm day today, and I am I'm wearing my summer uh, my summer gear. Why are there why are there cars just going out really slow? Well, you know what? We're gonna split lanes going up the hill. There's like a, a ton of cars, man. Look at that, man. Super Cub has enough power to, to climb the hill. Why are these people stopping here? I don't understand, man. All right, sorry guys. I don't think we're gonna get a good run up here because uh, these people are so slow. But hey, if we can keep up with traffic, that's good enough. Uh, that would be good enough for the light be uh, for, for the for the super cup. They are so slow, man. And now we've kind of dropped in, you know, we don't got enough uh, revs to get up here, man. I don't know if we'll be able to pass though. We need passing power, and we're going on the, we're on the pretty steep section. Well, let's wait till it levels out a little bit, and then we'll pass. <laughs> oh, there's a car coming. I'll hurry up. Why are people stopping when they're going down? I don't understand. Just don't pay attention to the, what's going around the other corner, man. You have your own lane. Yeah, look at that. We're passing cars going uphill. <laughs> These guys are going hella slow, dude. All right, here we go. Wide open throttle on third gear, 30 miles an hour. Woo! It, it's slowing. It, it's slowing down. We got to drop in the second. <laughs> oh my god, dude. So Hades Vegas wanted to see how it is to ride this thing on, on the mountain pass and it is not very exciting. I'm having to do second gear here. We don't have to, they're not going so fast where you know we can just like do some pretty fancy cornering man. But <laughs> whoa, 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 the back is sliding around a little bit. <laughs> what the 
it is so slow. It is not designed for... I, I'm surprised because in Japan there's a lot of mountain passes and stuff. You know, I would think some people would want to ride their Super Cub on mountain passes. It gets around the corners pretty well though, but we're not going fast is the problem. That's why it gets around the corners pretty well. It looks like second gear is what we're going to need to get up this thing. There we go, I got into third. We're doing 35. It's climbing. The gear counter is not working. Sometimes it doesn't work, I notice. <laughs> That's it! It's wide open, man! Woo! I've never had a bike that just, just you have to go wide open the whole way <laughs> to get up a hill, dude. Alright, down to it for the second. Woo! Whoa, man, what is it? It, it, uh, it sure uh, flips over. I mean, it, it sure uh, transitions pretty fast, man. <laughs> I'll tell you that. That was kind of impressive. We need, we need more, uh, more, more transitions, man. <laughs> We're almost to the top. It is not. Yeah, the power is definitely not impressive, but the handling is alright. I would give it that. Because it's such a small and light bike. I even wore my, the boots I use at the racetrack, so... <laughs> His wig is ready. The seat is not the best for, for hanging off, that's for sure. <laughs> it's so wide, you know? I think it's kind of better to, to ride it like a, flat, like a flat tracker. Oh, damn it. See, third gear, yeah. Don't go in the fourth gear, man. Fourth gear is like an overdrive. <laughs> it will not climb the hill. All right, yeah, this is the this is the kind of steep part of Sierra Hill. That's We're doing about 35 going up this section, guys, in third gear. Wide open throttle. Wide, that's all she's got, man. <laughs> Yeah, man, this thing could use a little more more guts, man. I'll tell you, it's a little gutless. I'll tell you that. I I confident to say that probably my uh, my dirt bike is faster than this, my KLX. All right, here we are. We made it. We made it to the top. We made it. We made it. I'm gonna park at the bike rack. <laughs> Whoops, that's the kickstand, man. Oh. Well, there we go. We made it. We made it up here with a max speed of 40. No, I don't even I don't even think we hit 42 coming up here, man. That was uh, <laughs> that was not a very impressive ride. I'll tell you that. But we've gone like six miles so far, so that's... I don't know why I brought the GPS. Is really, you know, for electric bike, you know, you might want to ra measure the range and stuff, but... Meow. Yeah. Okay, guys, that was not the most impressive ride ever, I'll tell you that. Yeah, I, I have to say that is the, the least... <laughs> impressive. I might as well just be riding a bicycle up here, you know? Well, I'm sure it's faster than a bicycle. Okay, so um, this is just a little bonus ride. We're just going to take a ride down uh, down this part of uh, Sierra Road. Very nice. It's a single it's a single lane road, so we're not going to... I won't be uh, going very fast, is what I'm going to say. You can't see what's around the corner. Oh, but, 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 don't go very fast. See? Stay on the right. For surprisingly, there's a lot of people up here today. It's a Wednesday. I There normally aren't this many people up here, you know? But man, those people were co that coming up here were so slow. Like, you could probably run faster than that, you know? That's how slow they were going. If, if you get passed by a Super Cub, man, you're going way too slow. <laughs> I'll tell you that, man. 
Oh, it doesn't do. It doesn't go over the bumps very well. I noticed that. The rear, the rear suspension, the rear shocks on this bike could be better. Is what I'm gonna say. I've caught it uh, bottoming out. I don't know if there's a way to adjust the preload on this. That would be nice. Wow, is it beautiful out here today? I just want to go for a ride, man. And uh, this super cup will do it, man. It'll get you out here, man. On two wheels. <laughs> That's for sure. Wow, look at all the flowers and everything. It's beautiful out here today. Okay, I saw a car. I saw a car there. Slow down here. See how narrow it is? <laughs> it's like Japan narrow, right? That's actually where this bike excels, it, riding in Japan. If you guys have never ridden in Japan, the streets are like so narrow, you know, this thing will zip in and out of stuff easily. All right, you know what? Maybe on the way down, we'll ride leg out, okay? Kind of like a, kind of like flat tracker style, all right? But man, is it a nice day to ride out here, I'll tell you that. I'm trying to ride it like like me, like uh, I'm trying to hang off the pegs and everything, and it's just, I don't know, it just doesn't feel right on this bike. I mean, I guess you could, but it's so small, I think you just ride it like a flat tracker is the best way to do it, you know. I think this is, this is where I stop normally, yeah. It says no stopping, but I, I stop. I stop here because uh, I'm on a bike, so that's my, that's my uh, privilege. <laughs> Let's get a quick picture. Wow, oh, so beautiful today, man. All right, here's me up. Can we do a burnout here on these rocks? Yes, yes we can. <laughs> All right. Okay, so we're gonna continue on our ride. We're gonna go ride back and then we're gonna do the downhill section. Here, I'm gonna get a shot next to those puppies. All right, downhill time! Downhill time! I have a feeling this is gonna be more exciting than the uphill. Hopefully. Okay, I'm gonna just take it easy going around this corner because it's blind. All right. There is quite a bit of traffic today, surprisingly. All right, let's get my knee down, man. <laughs> I did install a throttle uh, throttle rocker on this bike. I think it's pretty good. I kind of would like a quicker turn throttle, but I think this will work for now. It's cheap too, so I, it was free because I already had it, you know. You got a lot of people that don't know how to how to drive up here, you know. Just drive anywhere they want, you know. All right, here we go. Sierra Hill, Sierra Road, downhill section. If you guys don't know, Hayes Mega is more of a uphill rider, okay? I like twisting the throttle, but unfortunately, twisting the throttle doesn't do much on this bike. Yeah, I, got, I shoot you guys, I shoot you not, man. My light beam will go up here faster than this. At least it feels faster. <laughs> All right, here we go, downhill. Yeah, the back feels hella floppy on this bike. That's what I don't like. All right. Doing about 40 going down this hill. Oh, well, it'll definitely go downhill fast. Come on, hit 45. Can you do 45? Yeah, yeah, there we go. Oh, we're doing 50 right now. Woo! <laughs> All right, you better slow down. There's a corner coming up.
All right, at least we'll get to see how the handling is at higher speeds on this bike. There's a guy with the, I think it's the R1150 up here. It's kind of scary. Remember, use the engine braking if you, if you need to, man. Slow you down. I know I can hit 50 miles an hour on the light V here. Can we do it? Yep. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> okay, okay, slow down that. Yeah, I feel like just letting it roll down in third gear is good enough. Now we're in second gear. Third gear, doing 40. Man, it goes downhill a lot faster than it goes uphill. That's for sure. Might be somebody around the corner. All right. I could be confident knowing that this bike has ABS. So if I do brake really hard and lock up the wheel, it won't thing. Okay, we're in second gear. I'm gonna scrub some speed here. I try to, to knee out that one. I don't like going fast around that corner, guys, by the way. It's a nice corner, but like, uh, it, uh, the, um, it's slippery. Man, all I can say is the brakes don't feel very confident on this bike. Slowing this bike down on a, on a steep hill like this. Test, brake test. It's doing all right. Yeah, it doesn't really slow down all that much. <laughs> Fast downhill when you keep it in second. I do not, I do not want to drop it in the first. I'll tell you that. Wow, is it warm today? I'm gonna have to pass this forerunner, man. I think we're gonna do it, man. Now the rear brake doesn't have ABS though, so if you do want to skid the rear around, use the rear brake. But be, yeah, you gotta be, should be careful. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, second gear. Whoa, I bought him. <laughs> Something hit the, hit the ground there. <laughs> Yeah, this thing does not do very good of over bumps, I'll tell you that. I haven't scraped anything though. It means you're not trying hard enough, Merlin. Woo! Normally I could do a wheelie on that. Why oh, am I sweating a lot? Slow down, there might be a car. Okay. Second gear. I hope I'm not over revving the engine or anything. That's one, that's one thing I don't like about this bike, it doesn't have a tachometer either. So you don't know if you're over revving the engine or not, but I'm just, I'm trying to use the engine braking to slow me down in second gear. All right, let's go third gear. Yeah, it's kind of scary going down the hill. With <laughs> It doesn't slow down very fast, that's for sure. Woo! <laughs> I can't wait to take this thing up Mount Hamilton, man. Oh yeah, look at this! <laughs> I'm not the only one going out for a ride today. <laughs> All right, we're just kind of letting it roll down at, in third gear at 30-ish miles an hour. 
Um, yeah, it's very strange riding this bike. I'm not used to riding a bike that's so slow, you know. The brakes don't really inspire much confidence. The, you know, the engine braking isn't really all that strong. Uh, you know, it kind of bounces around when the when the road is bumpy. Yeah, it's not the not the most highest performance ride out there, man. But hey, it, it goes down the hill pretty fast, that's for sure. I kind of enjoyed it. I kind of want to do it again. <laughs> All right. So thanks, sir. Thanks for riding along. That is uh, the Hades Vega hill climb and downhill attack. Well, are we going to make this? Yeah. All right. <laughs> thanks. Uh, thanks for riding along. That. So that is a that's a little taste of what the Super Cub could do on uh, on the twisties, man. Uh, it's not wasn't very impressive. Definitely not impressive going uphill. <laughs> It was so slow going uphill, man. Wow, what is this guy doing? Can you, like, step on the accelerator pedal? Yeah, so, um, the max speed we hit was 52. Actually, we did go pretty fast going downhill. It does, it, it does feel kind of confident going a little, like, around 50 miles an hour. I wouldn't go past 50 miles an hour on this bike, you know, but, um, that's probably, that's probably about as fast you want to go on this really tight twisties that we just rode anyways, you know. Um, it ain't no, it ain't no sport bike, man. <laughs> that's for sure. But it was fun to ride, and hey, it got me up there. That's the point, you know. It got me up there, and I had a good time. I'm sure I hardly used up any gas too <laughs> getting up there. Still got a full tank. All right, so that was about, yeah, I think it's about like five, five-ish miles trying to go up there. So and we and we hit 52 miles an hour max speed on the downhill. Hit an average. Uh, we were doing an average 28 miles an hour. All right, and we've been out here for like half an hour. Okay. Oh, there we go. All right. Thanks for uh, thanks for coming along for the ride. That is the uh, on the Super Cub doing the Sierra Road hill climb and downhill. All right. I'll probably split the downhill and hill climb up into separate videos. All right. Thanks for watching. Here's Miguel. Alright guys, so yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed that, that hill climb and the downhill riding video of the Honda Super Cub. I have to say, it's quite gutless going uphill, okay? And you can't like really lean it all that much over, or else you start scraping the pegs and stuff. Um, but, but it's a whole lot of fun still. The, the important thing is, it'll get you there, it'll get you there, okay? It won't get you there very fast, but it'll get you there, alright? Alright, it's big up. <laughs>